Hey there, welcome to TCM, I'm Ben Mankiewicz. Coming up next is part of our October Festival of films focusing on apparitions, spirits, and poltergeists, another haunting horror comedy from Columbia in 1963. It's The Old Dark House. The film was adapted from a couple of sources. First, a book benighted by English novelist J.B. Priestley, and second, the original big screen adaptation of that book a 1932 film directed by James Whale. This 1963 version was financed by Hammer Studios in collaboration with director William Castle's own production company, William Castle Productions. Not surprisingly then, the movie is directed by William Castle, a master of B-movie horror. Castle's biggest successes, the 1959 version of House on Haunted Hill and the 1960 version of 13 Ghosts. This William Castle film, The Old Dark House, tells the story of an American car salesman, played by Tom Poston, who discovers the English client he has just sold a car to is not exactly of this world. And from that point on, the salesman is hurled into the mishaps of his client's eccentric living family. The plot is admittedly a little all over the place, but it's fairly typical of the type of B picture William Castle was known for producing. The oddities of the plot are really part of the charm. From 1963, with a cast that includes Robert Morley, Jeanette Scott, and Peter Bull playing two parts, here's The Old Dark House. 